Hey everybody, Anthony from Hashonet here, and today we are at the Second Life Science Fiction Convention, which is part of the American Cancer Society Relay for Life Weekend. And for those of you in the United States, it looks it is of course uh, Memorial Day weekend. And um, we're going to take a tour of both setups. Uh, first, the Science Fiction Convention, and then the Relay for Life. Uh, this is a charity fundraiser. So, um, take that as it is. Uh, you can go to uh, cancer.org, search up Second Life, and actually donate to it. And um, I'm going to do something really quick. So, hold on one sec. As you see, I forgot to do things, so... I'm setting it up now. Uh, yeah. There we go. Uh, I kind of jumped the gun there, but uh, give me a sec to figure out what I'm doing. Uh, there we go. So professional I am. Oh, ha <laughs> Okay, there we go. Uh. Okay, let's see. Um. Oh, messages. Okay, gotcha. Yay. Um. Wow, they're really chatty, aren't they? Okay, so <laughs> now, now that I've finished that. Uh, so apparently they have, this is at an island called, uh, I guess, Sci-Fi Con 14. And this is the hub. And uh, they have a couple of events going on right now, which is a, a cyber stage in a rooftop bar. And... Um, we go around the center core here, and in this design, if if you if if I like fly up, you'll see it is kind of reminiscent of a spoke pattern. It kind of reminds me of uh, what is that Stargate? So, you know that, and uh, let's see. Oh, and then. Got to remember that the mouse has to be on this screen here. And so I think how we're going to start this is we're going to, well, here. Uh, here is the core here. We're going to just fly around. I, I was originally thinking about walking around, but I think that would take a lot of time. And uh, I've allotted an hour time for this. So as you see, they have like display sets up with logos of companies here or uh I guess islands here on Second Life. And then I, I'm going to assume these are booths. But if you're in Second Life and it's secondlife.com, you can, of course, donate to one of these little kiosks here if you have money on your Second Life account. And, yeah, so here's a storefront here. And, uh, yeah, it's a couple of storefronts. This is it's a, Every year there's a different design. So that is interesting. I'm not going to go into them, uh, but let's go check out the next uh, little island here. And there's music on this, but uh, unless you're hearing it through my mic, I actually have the sound from it muted. So um, um, mainly so I don't have to deal with any type of copyright striking. But uh, this is apparently a stage for an event which isn't currently happening. And let's continue on. Wow, this gets a lot more detailed. I feel like there is a connector to the next island, which looks like it's down there. And we'll go there momentarily. So I'm gonna try not I'm gonna try to make that last. So going into the next thing here. It's another stage area. Ah. There's a statue in the middle. Or maybe it's just a statue. I, 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 I actually not looked at anything yet. 
but uh, usually the center island is uh, light on material and created because there is an event happening. I think it's a thousand meters up. And there's like the main stage. Man, that is detailed. Okay, and then on to the next one. I am not sure what the art style here is. Uh, Oh, okay, so this has some type of automated thing happening. Oh, no, there, there's actually people dancing. Wow. Interesting. Oh, let's see what the uh, Relay for Life has right now for the team here that does the, the convention. And it looks like it has... Oh, the ACS total is 90 million... Uh, dollars, but that's Second Life dollars. Uh, if, if if the exchange rate is still two hundred and thirty, uh, I'll just round out the ninety million. So that's about uh, four hundred thousand dollars has been raised USD. So that's pretty good, and it says the convention has raised two thousand. Oh, sorry, two million on its own. So, uh, I should have kept the calculator out. So, let's say... Let's say three million since it's rounded up there. Uh, it's about uh, $12,000. So, that's how much the convention has raised so far this weekend. And uh, let's continue on to the next stop. Here's another store. Apparently, they have a live singer going on right now in the club on uh, in the main stage area. Because I can hear the song Jolene playing. And it's being sung live. Another stage area. As, as further I get, some things de-res, but uh, once I get close enough, it'll res back in. Okay, so I'm going to lower myself and, and walk across this. And we're going to, uh, hopefully things will load up as I go through. There's some people up front. And experience some lag as things load up. There's a lot, a lot to load up here. It's another storefront. Oh, so somebody just, yeah, they're exploring about, yeah, because you can buy things with uh, Second Life credits. And, and the exchange rate, I think, is actually two, 270. So divide any U.S. dollar amount by 270 and get the exchange rate. Or not, any Second Life dollar amount by 270 gets the U.S. dollar exchange rate, approximately. So uh, we are on the island Petrolgeist, I guess. Oh, there it is. I was waiting for the road to load. So we are, okay, so we are in a new island. I'm not quite sure what the style is. It looks kind of cyberpunky, like Stargate uh, uh, Andromeda or SG One or what? Or no, not SG One. Andromeda, right? Or no? What was the uh, man? I haven't seen Stargate in such a long time. Hold on, I gotta mute the. There's that singing that song is. There we go. I think what they did is the live entertainment is broadcast through all the the islands. Literally another one kicked on. So the common areas sh share the, the live stuff. Okay. Atlantis. Stargate Atlantis. That's what I was thinking of.
you know what? I have a solution for this because they keep turning on. I'm just going to mute it all. There we go. Okay. <laughs> the little robots you can acquire. So this is another store. So essentially, uh, what the dealio is here is um, if you want to participate in the event, uh, you can pay for uh, space and set up a display. And all the displays have to have this Relay for Life um, stand for donations. So it's a donation kiosk. And everybody has different styles. They're obviously supposed to be sci-fi related, but then there's some stores and some other different styles. So people can be a little bit more creative and not be strictly limited to, like, say, Star Trek or Star Wars or whatever. And uh, just checking something really quick. Uh... Um, don't mind me, I am just doing things. Yeah, I just wanted to make sure that the stream was playing because I got, uh, don't mind me. oh, yep, there it goes. Because <laughs> uh, I got this uh, little thing saying I've only been running for 10 minutes. I'm like, that can't be right. Um, anyway. <sighs> Ooh. This is some uh, some nice structures starting to load up here. I guess I'm in the square for this particular island. Let's fly up. Wow, this is some industrial age stuff going on here. Look at that. For some reason, I would think my graphics card would be working a lot harder, but it is. Whoa. A big old cube. And I think the day just changed. Okay, as we continue on. Uh, wow, the lack of sound entirely is not... There, that's much better. At least for right now, anyway. Okay, so New Horizons. Okay, that's their booth. Could travel a little faster if I'm down here. Datoon. Oh, this is. Oh, Jedi Enclave. Okay, it's clearly Star Wars. So, all right, it looks like I got message. Hold on, let's see what it is. Oh, it's just the uh, Second Life Sci Fi Convention. Alrighty. I'm going to close this back out. Alrighty. Here's this gigantic cube. Oh, wow. You want to impress me? Make that a board cube. You, you got me impressed if that was super board cube. I, it's just a, yeah, it's a transparent surface, so you go up to the, wait a minute, does it lead into something? Oh, crap, it does. Look at that. And there's people here. Wow, that is interesting. Oof, I bounced myself on the other side there. Okay, how do you go? Alrighty, up to the next place. Where do we got here? Uh, I remember, uh, oh, what was it? Like, uh, when I started this thing in 2009, the, uh, I, I, I had a crappier computer and things seemed to load faster, but now that, like, we're, what, 13 years later and everything is a lot more detailed, uh, now... <laughs> Now I'm back to everything is loading super slow. I don't know what language that is or what symbol that is. Is this Star Wars? I have no idea. 
And I'm going to go walk inside just because I can't tell. There's somebody here. Oh, well, there you go. That answers that. It is Star Wars. Okay. Backy outie. Oh, this is a Star Wars island. I, I mean, I assume that's what the Galactic Senate Row and Decibel Anthro Way. Okay. So we'll, we'll go to the next one. There's a lot of people here. Oh, they're pony. There are bronies here. You got some brony stuff going on. Yeah. Yeah, some bronies. They even exist in virtual conventions, people. Okay. Actually, now that I muted the music, maybe I can put the sound on. Here we go. Now, you, they twinkle. Do you hear that? Okay, on to the next area. Uh, I think they're following me. Wow, these are incredibly detailed. I kind of wish some of the more detailed or higher resolutions would load faster. Because uh, when we finish with this, we're going to go to the Relay for Life, which is based on the Cancer, uh, their main island. So I would end up going to uh, that island and then starting there and going around to, uh, to just basically follow the track. And uh, it's, it's something like 20, 25 islands long, so it gets uh, pretty... Uh, pretty long, so I, I feel like I'm going to fly across it. But uh, let's see. Uh, I feel like this bump is a, a crossover. So let's see what it does. Bloop. Yep, we just entered a steampunk one. Uh Axiantos Barracks? I don't know what that means, but here here we are. So I guess the islands do have different theming. Ooh, this one needs to load because it's a lot of gray right now. Unless this is supposed to be what it looks like. It's supposed to... Oh, it's snow covered. Okay. Wow. Sailor's Promenade. And Circus Avenue. I don't remember doing street names when I was in charge. So that is definitely new. I'm gonna fly. Wow, oh, hey, somebody's just standing here. I have a person standing here. Wow. Man, people are so talented. I can't even read that. It looks like some type of Federation thing, but it has a Star Wars symbol in it. The cemeterium? Well, that sounds droll. What? Oh, the day's changing again. Okay. What are we at now? Brother Karnak Walk? Okay. Wow. I'm kind of curious very unmarked building. Ah, oh, it's just, just for imagery. Okay. That maybe was something you can go in. Oh, this one definitely is. What is this place? Oh, it's some type of arboretum. No, it was greenhouse is what I'm thinking of. Uh, and then you can buy things. 
Now, if you see any of these kiosks, uh, you can buy things and they donate the money to the American Cancer Society. So, that's what those are. And keep in mind, Second Life is free to play. Uh, it, it makes its money off of the the currency. Uh, basically, people putting money into the system. Uh, which is pretty much how most MMOs are anyway. And yes, technically, this is an MMO. Wow. This must be a store. Pipe organ. Mm. And some type of warp. Okay. Okay, I kind of see what they did. If they had any openings, they put, uh, like, faced buildings to occupy the space. I'm going to put up a map of some type. I'm going to get rid of this. That way I have some type of idea where I am instead of kind of just guessing at it. Okay, I see. So we started at this first island up here. We crossed over to here and then walked this way. So we technically should go through oops, this island we were just in to the other side, which we would see the other half, and then go to the next island. Yep. So that's pretty much what we're doing. Okay. Oop, wrong way. I'm going to fly, though. Oof. So that would take us back to where we were. So we're back at a full circle already, I think. So let's go down this part for a sec. Ooh, what is this? It's a fancy banner. Looks like the Boy Scout sign with some flowers on it. I don't. Oh, there we go. House Artratus. I don't. I don't. Hmm. Man, this is really... It is steampunk up and down. It reminds me of that one um, city in Pokemon uh, Sword and Shield uh, where we have to go up elevators and stuff. It's very steampunky. Sector 22 comics? I'm uh, curious. Oh, Okay. Ready. Continuing on. Ooh, what? Oh, here's another large building. All right, wait, is this where we came in at? Yes, yeah, where we came in at. I'm gonna load up a big map real quick. Okay, so we started at, okay, we started at Sci-Fi Con. We went to Petrol Geist. Okay, so we want to go towards this Circuit Circuit James. I feel like it's Hispanic. Circuit Wands. Huh. So here, let's just like set a beacon, I guess, and hopefully we'll end up going the right way. So real quickly, let's see, we already went that way. So let's go this way and then go through the place where we want to go. Oh, there's a poster. It says, okay, the stargates are clues. Okay, so they're doing a, a search where you can uh, touch for clues. Uh, it says stargates are hidden in place sight around the con. Touch the stargates to get a clue. Each clue from one of six digits needs to solve a gate address. Once you solve the clues to get all six digits, go to the big stargate and dial the address to decipher. Oh, that's kind of cool. So it does that gate thing like an SG-1 in Atlantis and stuff. And then if you decide the correct address, you will be sent to a secret location for a bonus gift. And then <laughs> the caption says, not responsible for loss of tribbles while Starwolf Pilfers your pockets as you travel through the gates 
wormhole. Okay. So that's a scavenger hunt. Okay, let's continue on. Oh, what's going on here? It's like an escape room. I'm not gonna do it, but I'm kinda curious. Oh, okay, so, so it's probably puzzle-based. Okay, so I think we can safely head to the other island. Oof. What do we got going on here? It'll load eventually. I hope. Maybe. Oh, there you go. Be the chain in Superman. Okay, give me one sec. I am I'm going to get something to drink. Okay, good. My throat was getting dry there. Okay. So, let's continue on the journey here. Sailor's Promenade. Ziggy Stardust Street. Okay. So, we're, okay, so that's Steampunk and then this is Cyberpunk. And I think we turned off here, so we'll continue this way. Hi, somebody. Bye, somebody. There's a bar. <laughs> okay. What's this one? This chat. Loading. Oh, I don't know what that is. I mean, that's obviously the female symbol. I take it this is some type of store. Hmm. Zoom on along. There's a Stargate. Let's see what it says here. You think with a 200 megabits connection, this thing would load a lot faster, but nope. Nope, nope, nope. So, okay, it's the same sign as before. Good to know. So let's see. Let me uh, go back to here. Uh, dial the address that you deciphered. Huh. Kind of curious. This looks sort of familiar, but let's... See what it does. Oh. Just making stuff up. There's, I have nothing. Nah, I failed. So, <laughs> I guess I can't just make things up. 
Oh well. Here we go. What's this? Just the tip, funny. Okay, continuing on. And I'm thinking to myself as I walk through here, you know, there's that Roblox thing. I'm like, can they robots make stuff just detailed? You know, like, why isn't there more people here than in Roblox? But you know, maybe because of kids in Roblox. This is Second Life is not really a kid's place. I'm going to be honest with you. I mean, there are adult places on uh, Second Life, but in general, it's probably not a kid's place. Ood, Odd Road. Uh, Ood, Odo Road. Oh, like Deep Space Nine Odo. Okay. And it says Jackie Wells. That name sounds familiar. I don't know why. Another Section 31. Must be like a store chain or something on Second Life. There's another store. Uh, wow, that... Huh. Oh, this one really went off into a new area. Like a back alley. Let's zoom in. Any moment now, I may be killed. Ha ha. <laughs> Oh, that's a pretty hackery setup there. Let's see what's over here. Wow, the detail just wow. Alrighty. Continuing on. Okay, where are we at now? And check something out real quick. Lasers Lane, and then Jackie Wells. Whoa, that's a huge, like, aquarium-looking thing. Well, that is... We entered Violet Streak. I was like, where was I supposed to be going? Now I gotta look at the world map. Oh, okay, it looks like we crossed over an intersection. Oh, oh, we were in, okay. So the, uh, hmm. So that's where I'm looking. Okay, that's where we just were. So now we're in Violet Streak. Okay. Gotcha. So then Forestalgia is the next one after that. But uh, curious about something. So one sec. And bloop. Okay. I'm trying to swim in non water. Anyway, let's go back to ooh, here. Relay for life. Oh, it's a maze. That's 
It's amazing. Eh. Oh, wow. So this is like a lot of greenery. Here's a little hut. And here's a Star Trek thing. See what this has to say. USS Mercury. Little online offline tags, but they're both offline. So it's a role playing group. Interesting. Okay, let's go back the other way. Although I guess technically most groups on here would be role playing groups. Ooh, what's this say? It says Starfleet Command. United Federation of Planets. Well, that's kind of like everybody, isn't it? Outpost 79 Pacifica. Okay. What do we got here? Another theater. Okay. Solaris, I guess. What does this say? National Space Society in Second Life. Yes. So one of these boxes, you click on it and you get information about their group. The Forrest Kelly Drive. And T'Challa Avenue. I'm starting to get the idea that these streets are named after people who've passed. Although I guess Rene Arbor Jones would have been long to type, so Oda was chosen instead. There's another Star Trek group, I believe. Let's go take a look at that. The person in charge of this booth is offline, apparently. Yeah. Renegade Starfleet. Which is funny, I swore Starfleet Renegades was a fan-made program that you can find on YouTube. It might be the same people, I don't know. Continuing on. It says we should turn right here. What is a pathway through the center of the... Okay, so we're going to go to the next island. Because keep in mind, we still have to go through the Relay for Life. So as soon as we get through this circle, we'll head to the Relay for Life. Uh, I will start at the American Cancer Society Island because I believe that it would be the perfect place for it. And that's apparently it's clouds in the sky. Yeah, we're we'll switched to nighttime. Oh, there's a, a, an event board. So let's check this out. Let's wait for it to load. Now, I believe these times are Pacific because that's where Second Life is based is in California. And it says 6 p.m. Pacific. Jail and Bale, Roxy Z, Chronotis, Life Singer, Escape Room with Ewin, hosted by Lara. Oh, okay. This board actually might just change while we're, I'm reading this because it is actually about to become 7 p.m. Pacific time. Looks like events stop here around 10 o'clock. Uh, so 7 p.m. says Snoot's Dwagon Live. Keep in mind, this is for t uh, today, May 28th. 8 p.m., Cemeterian presents DJ Lestat. Oh, I've, I've, I've done his show. I've been to his show before. He's okay. Uh, 10 p.m., Multiverse Movies, Transformers 4, Age of Extinction. Do you know to do movies in Second Life, you have to buy a license? Just like if you were showing it in your like an event. You, you actually have to buy a license, and those are something you can get on Second Life. So, I mean, if you ever thought about showing a movie virtually... Anyway, uh, tomorrow, Sunday, May 29th, it's uh, 6 a.m. coffee and chat with Melina. Uh, I think it's for Melina Firefox. 
Uh, 9 a.m., the Star Wars 77 disco with Boba Fett, or Booba Fett, which we just saw uh, a little bit ago. Uh, she was idling in her little uh, Star Wars base. It says Sunday service, sci-fi spirituality, uh, near future temple host. Okay. Uh, 11 a.m., DJ Nicola, Nicola's opening for Duck House. I feel like there's probably supposed to be a space there. Hmm. 12 p.m., uh, Dreammaker Sci-Fi Fashion Show. And then at 1 p.m., Alien Walkthrough Doc House Band. Oh, I think it's about to update itself. So watch it update itself live. Or maybe not. It just refreshed, maybe? Hold on, I'm going to respond to this. Um, let them know I'm, do I'm doing a live stream tour. Okay. Let's close this back out. I would have been cool to see it change. I have seen them change before. It, it kind of reminds you of like one of those airport boards back in the old days. Okay. So. I'm not. Hmm. So I assume it goes uphill here, but let's, let's go around the long way. Some rockets. It was thought it was empty, I guess. Family video. That's kind of funny. Although it says, hmm. Mecca Drive and Stargate Way. Uh, I think this is hilarious. Uh, it's a little short. I'm a little too tall. Hold on. Um, let them know like uh, live streaming to Twitch. A and then they can see the interaction of me talking to them about me live streaming to Twitch. Anyway, let's close that out. It's kind of funny. It's like, can I zoom in? And can I go into this? It looks like an arcade. Oh, wow. Look at that. I am definitely too big for this building. But that is detail right there. That is awesome. Now, obviously, I can't play the game, so these are just images, like GIFs. But, wow. Some classic, classic games from Namco. I can't, uh, I can't walk behind them or anything, but that's fine. You know, always, it's basically a, for show, but that's fine. And then we can exit out. No biggie. Okay, continuing on. We've got another store to the right called Club. And uh, some type of tunnel. What is this saying here? They must have decided to do the scavenger hunt separate from each uh, vendor because I guess maybe they were just too hard. Speed limit 35. I'm not even flying anything. What is up here? It's a car that has been crashed. Uh-oh. I think we're going to somewhere secret. Let's zoom in.
I don't know where we're at, but some type of secret underground. Wow, this is just wow. Okay, let's see where it comes out at. All right, no, it keeps going. Where? It's like a subway station. Wow, that is wow. And this is underground, like you can't just see it from outside. It's a birthday cake. <laughs> jump over that I have no idea where I'm coming out at there's a fire truck well that was interesting uh, okay well look at that that is a, uh, oh, is it a car place? It says Vision Motors. Okay, so these people have developed their own vehicles. Oh, that's actually kind of neat looking. Wow. There's Bender. The Iron Giant. Oh, looky at that. That's some old school break there. Ooh, what is this? It looks like a tractor. Oh, it's like a bus. Huh. Okay, continuing on. What does this say? Phoenix Ascending. So it's a Star Trek group because of the emblem behind it. It's like a base of some type. Ember Road and Bad Wolf Boulevard. Oh, Doctor Who reference. Okay. I need to find out where our next stop is. And it's right here. So that must be the next island over there. sec tweak something bothering me a little bit there we go oh did I fudge it up I think I fudged it up hold on now I know what to do there we go I just wanted to enlarge the screen as best as I can to make it look uh, a little bit better so you can see the detail a little bit Ooh, another nice car oh this is like a little mall in here okay well, that's a lot of pink red rocket cola hmm feel like it's an in the window. Is there an upstairs? Yep, 
Yeah, there is a whole nother floor. Okay, so. I mean, wow, like the more complicated these builds are, I'm gonna fly tacos. I could eat some tacos, I tell you. Okay, so basically I'm flying over where you're just at. And it says the next island is straight ahead, but there is a building in the way. So let's see, how do I... Ah, there it is. There's the exit. Go to the ground here. There's a banana place we saw earlier. Ah! Oh, I bonked my head. Okay, now we're at Cheeseburger, so let's set the direction for the next island. Clearing out messages. So the next island is Kalon. Why does that sound familiar? <laughs> Welcome to New York. And this one's called Cheeseburger. So this one's American, I guess? Mm, it definitely looks modern. Wow, look at the car. It's too bad you can't drive these things inside this island. This is a Nissan? It must be a concept car. Looks kind of like a Red Mach 5 to me. Ooh, that one's tiny. Like, do they make you Transformers? This is a Subaru 360, wow. People replicated real cars in here. That one looks like a Beetle. This one's loading very slowly. Looks like a Ford. Let's continue on. Another vehicle. Ooh, Captain America's shield. Let's see what's up here. I want to say that's the German poster of uh, Civil War. Don't quote me on that. Bruce Banner Boulevard and Blink Street. Well, now I'm now I'm confused. Bruce Banner isn't dead. And neither is Blink 52, 82, 62, 69. Blink 69. No, that's not right. Blink 128. Blink 64. I don't remember the name of the band. There's somebody over here, but what's this group's name? Ah, it's a mech group. Ha ha ha. Oh, looky at that. There's a giant mech. Tis mectacular. Let's uh, go up to its level. Interesting. Okay. Here's a taxi cab. Somebody's office. Brooklyn Pier. Oh, that's right. We're in New York. I, I almost forgot. Rooftop bar. Hey, is this the rooftop bar one of those places doing an event? I don't know if they're doing it right now. I, of course, have the live music button turned off so I, you know, can do this. Oh, I was going to say that. Oh, wow, looky. We're going to check this one. That's Ecto. And we're going to go inside here and check that out. Ghostbusters. Give this a sec to load and see what it says. Okay. 
as you watch my half put together live stream, <laughs> remember to subscribe and like because it makes me feel better about myself. Anyway, thanks for trying the new equipment to interact with uh, ECU food fuel. You must be standing within three meters. Pack will wear down stamina. Wow. Okay, this is a Ghostbusters RP group. And they actually have, wow, they have 773 ghosts stored. Oh, it's Vigo. And, and for reference, uh, anything that loads in Second Life is typically where your camera's pointed. Yeah, that's Vigo, the Carpathian. Okay. That was cool. Let's move on to the next thing. Blink 82? Uh, that's going to bother me now. Blink 182. Blink 182 sound right? I feel like it's right. I mean, post in the comment and I'll, I'll you know, it'll tell me. Uh, what is this saying? Primus Road? No, maybe not. Huh. Being weirdly slow. Yeah. Anyway, another cab. What's this over here? Sci-fi group. Uh, Raise a cult. Oh, that's classic. Oh, that is awesome. Ramus Road. Well, that makes sense. Harold Ramus and all. I wonder what these symbols above the buildings mean. I, I think one is Instagram. I don't... The other one, MasterCard? I don't know. It looks familiar. I just can't place it. Arkham Asylum. Here are some people. Okay, we about center square. Yeah, here it is. Here's the center square for this particular one. Oh, it's lanterns. It's like green lantern, black lantern. So it's uh, DC Comics lantern themed. And that's kind of clever. And there's a bunny. Delicious, delicious bunny. Haas and Feffa. Okay. Continuing on. Run away this way. Is that the Hulk? That is the Hulk, isn't it? That is the Hulk. And that looks like Deadpool over to the left. Wow. And then let's go check out these two here. Either that or Miles Morales Spider-Man. Or Black Panther and Deadpool. Maybe I was right the first time. Yeah, definitely Deadpool on the right. And I'm going to go with Black Panther on the right here. Oh, dude, that caught me off guard. It is Sony Spider-Man. But that's Deadpool. Okay, that is nifty. What is going on with the phone booth? This is a building store, I guess. It's how you buy these buildings. Mm, day shift. Or is it no nighttime? Yeah, it's nighttime now. There's another mech place. Uh, okay. 
think I'm near the wall of this one. Um, I might be going the wrong way. Oh. There's a tunnel. See what the message is here. Now I'm running a 1660 Ti. It was a GeForce card uh, with uh, six gigs of onboard, and then it sucks like 32 gigs of virtual RAM from my. Hard drive slice RAM. I don't know, memory. I have like oh, yeah. So best at lion. Uh, one of our friends who passed away from cancer, or not cancer, uh, COVID, uh, last year. She used to help me organize this thing uh, when I was in charge. Um, so yeah, it's good to see her name on on the wall there. So here we go. Okay, let me set the waypoint for the next one. Okay, New Xantis is the next island, and then we go to the American Cancer Society. There's a dancing stormtrooper. Uh, tomorrow on H&E Games' YouTube channel, uh, I, I uh, did the story of Lego Star Wars Skywalker Saga. Uh, that... Um, I did the second episode, which is Attack of the Clones, so if you, if you want to waste four and a half hours watching somebody play a video game, uh, I recommend access that. <laughs> H&E Games channel at noon and tomorrow and Sunday Eastern Time. I'm going to continue going straight here. And we're going to cross over into the next island. Wow, that was actually seamless. Let me set the next waypoint. Bloop. It gets back to where, you know, a lot, well, nearly where we started. Uh, so you see Kirk Wingtips here. He's actually the guy who took over from me. Um, almost done circling. Uh, going to uh, ACS or RFL next. This is all ACS. RFL next. Uh, and then tell them I'm on Twitch. Uh, at Haslegenet Bloop. And I'll close this out. There's some type of hydraulic sound coming from somewhere. Okay, so this looks kind of like Star Wars. Hey, there's Molina. Firehawk. Oh, fi I said Firefox. Yeah, she's maybe idle. Okay, so. Yeah, this looks like Tatooine. Oh, phooey. Eh. If you don't promote yourself, who's going to promote you? Well, actually, this one loaded up pretty pretty quickly compared to the rest of them. So this is... Uh, she wants to have a conversation. I, I kind of need to get through this. I have other things. But I promised Kirk I would come and check this out, so... Here we are. I now my honest opinion is super impressed. Every year it gets better, and every year my graphic card seems to fail <laughs> even worse than the previous year. Balls Avenue, really? This is the way. Well, that's the Mandalorian. That makes sense. Uh. Just 
today this is my second live stream of the day the previous uh, live stream uh was a transformers related one where we covered the tier list for uh the war for cybertron kingdom toy line and then next week we are doing the uh, studio series shattered glass toy lines so it looks like this is a store And let's see what we got here. Another store. Did I just, oh, okay. I just ran too fast down the stairs. Ooh, what is this? Wait for it to load. Tattoo. Tattoo Nutriskelia. Oh, it's a Star Trek one. Okay. It's kind of weird in a Star Wars setting, but I, I guess, I guess sci-fi, sci-fi, eh? Oh, I think he messaged me back. Uh, uh okay. Okay, we'll converse with her after the live stream. Okay, here we go. Bowls. And it says Atheris Avioe. I don't, I don't know what it is. Avenue, though. Uh, uh, let's see. Another theater. What playing at this one? Oh, oh it's a puppet show. So it must be automated. So as we continue on... Sailor V Creations. Wow, they've been here for a while. Uh, there's a couple of groups that have been on Second Life for years creating items for people to purchase. And uh, just apologies in advance for anybody who, who I like walked around and I didn't see their stuff. Uh, time is limited. and I, I uh, It's already 10.30 p.m. Eastern here. And I've been live streaming... With a small break in the middle since 5.30 p.m. Eastern. So, yeah. Okay, and I think I am back to Cheeseburger. But instead of loading a new island, what I'm going to do is jump right to the American Cancer Society for the Relay for Life. So, let's uh, do that. Um... Wow, I got some old landmarks. Um, there we go. So I'm going to zoom out, and you're going to see this. If it'll let me. So here is where we are right now. I'm right here at the border of these two islands. The American Cancer Society, the Relay for Life, is happening on a whole bunch. Let's see if I can get it. Like a whole, whole, like these are multiple together, all following the same pattern. And apparently they're currently having a very large event here on their second island. And then these are, these are offshoots. I don't think they have anything directly to do with it. And we're not going to go to these, but we are going to go to these. So let's teleport right to the Relay for Life island. And I just fell in the water. Awesome. Let's just fly up. Ooh. Okay. Which is funny. Um, this area is... And I fell right down again. Doof. This is the bad part of... Come on, just, there we go. It's a little laggy as it loads. This is where I usually load into Second Life because this island is always here and is oh it's been here since 2009 at least. And you can see everything is loading up around here. And so, uh, like the 
the uh, the sci-fi convention islands, the Relay for Life islands, uh, they do the Relay for Life actual walk pattern. So they do, and I'll show the world map again. Uh, let's see if I can get it all to load. So each of these have a like a, a name relative to one of the core attributes of the American Cancer Society. And um, uh, well, I'm actually surprised about these islands being here. But the, these groups must have paid for them to be attached to these islands. Anyway, as you see... Uh, each of these opens up, and then what you're seeing, this gray line here, this is the actual relay course. So it's an H shape this year. Um, they've really gone really, really far out here. These must be private because I can't access them. Like, I can't even get information on them. But these are fine. So, again, we we'll only be focusing on these anyway. I think we would go this way, and this would be the point you want to end up eventually before we turn right. And along the paths are booths, and every group has a portion, if not a whole, island in each of these squares, uh, to, I think 256 by 256 meters is an island, and then uh, they're, they're, they're told to decorate it. And like, and for example, there's this square here, uh, four groups apparently have this one, and they've, they've maybe decorated different things and then as, as you see like this is a island this is an island so i think that's how we're going to play this trip i'm kind of fly through it i don't know what's going on here right now obviously it's some type of an event uh it is and i don't know if i mentioned this uh it's a memorial day weekend so it's a perfect weekend to do something like this and the convention and the relay for life are here until at least Sunday, if not Monday. Uh, actually, I think there's a schedule, maybe. So let's see if we can find it somewhere. Uh, no, there's just resources. Well, we might find it as we walk along. Let's see. I'm going to go this way. So let us start. And uh, we're heading towards our first destination. Now, um... Once we get out of here, I think that's when I'm going to start flying. So things are going to load. You're not going to load all the way, obviously. But uh, but we'll see. Now, I... Hmm. It's awfully empty. I figured it, they'd have... Uh, oh! Is the Relay for Life not happening yet? Hold on. I have an idea. Or are they doing it next weekend? Because it would be the perfect weekend this weekend. But I have an idea. Hold on. Because I mean, I'm I'm not planning to come back next weekend to do the tour of the separate islands. Okay, where are we at? Okay, so they're doing something here. Oh, it's a concert. Okay, I don't I don't know anybody here, so I don't want to interrupt whatever event this is. So let's go to. Oh wait, I'm not even where I teleported to. Did I get automatically moved here? Yes, I did. Hmm. Oh, wow, I didn't realize it was that far up. Well, I am falling, so there's that. <sighs> I have no idea where I'm going. Uh, let's see, world map. Oh, 1620. Well, that is, that is, that is high. It's just teleport. <laughs> Oh, there we go. Smack in my face. I got a message somewhere. Hold on. 
Somebody sent me a message, hey. Uh, okay. Lovely messages. Yay. Okay. Um, now I have to look, because I thought the Relay for Life was happening now, because usually the sci-fi connection uh, convention is connected to this island here. So I'm a little... Con Confused? Maybe, maybe the Relay for Life is next weekend. So let me uh, uh, let me just do a general search, and uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. American Cancer Society Relay for Life Second Life, and click the event, and let's see what it says for the date. That didn't work. Let's try this again. Okay, here we go. Um, oh, it's June 11th, so they're just setting up now. That's why I can't get in. Okay, so we are literally two weeks too early. And I'm going to show you their webpage. So give me a sec here. So here is the page for the... Uh, American Cancer Society's uh, Relay for Life, which is in two weeks. I thought it would be this week, or maybe... Oh, no, that makes sense, because if, if it was happening now, and then, well, the other islands are just... Well, wow, they're planning early this year. Uh, but anyway, here is the page. Um, you basically go to the acsevents.org site and search Second Life, and you'll end up here. And right here it says um, Saturday, June 11th. It starts at 10 a.m., which is Pacific time. SLT is Second Life time, which is which is Pacific time. And then, of course, you can go here and donate as well as participate. And then there is Facebook and Twitter in which you can follow. And um, they have events already, apparently. Oh, okay. So right now what's happening is... Oh, it's the Fantasy Fair. Which, but, okay. Hmm. I'm, I'm, there's maybe those other islands, but no. If it was a Fantasy Fair, I'd be able to get in. So there's a... Uh, this starts May 1st. Let's see what it says here. Wow, their calendar is full. They got a lot going on. Because right here... Okay, Shred Fest. That explains the concert. Let's see if I can... Oh, much better. So, things happening. Uh, Sci-Fi Con. See, there's just the Sci-Fi Con. And, um... Wow, I really have it. Crayon Garden, Escape Room. Wow, they really have it all planned out. Huh. Okay, so... What did it say? The 11th? Yeah, 11th. So we go to the eleventh. Ah, relay weekend right there, eleventh, eleventh, or twelfth, and then okay, and then they usually leave the displays up for a uh, week or so, so people can check them all out. So I don't know if they're gonna go available next week after the seventh or or whatever, but uh, yeah, that is the schedule again. Um, ACSevents.org. Uh, you can go there, search for Second Life, you'll find this page, and uh, you can download, you can get the app, you can donate, you can join, so those are all the things you can do. Uh, again, right now, you can, uh, of course, explore the Second Life Science Fiction Convention. Uh, it's the 14th one, 13th year. I did... And before you go, why is it one up? It's because I think the, the in 2010, I did two of them. Because the first and second one did so well. Uh, so that is why there is one more than you think there should be. <laughs> so, yeah, check that out. And uh, with that said, um, thank you for watching. Uh, I encourage you to donate to the American Cancer Society. And uh, sorry for the unprofessional sloppiness of my starting stream. 
I, I kind of got distracted and forgot what I was doing. But we're, we're here now. And uh, go ahead and donate. Remember to like and subscribe. Twitter, YouTube. I'm also on Facebook, Twitch, or yeah, Twitch, um, Instagram. Search for H and E Games or at Haslage and at H A S L A G N E T. Thanks for watching.